All right, Mr. Fogelson back. Uh, ready for my game frame video number four. Practice what you preach, practice what you teach. Okay, let's uh, kind of take off where we last were at with our last video. So we're going to go ahead and put in our micro SD adapter with our micro uh, card from our game frame. Um, and you'll notice here we've got a massive amount of files. Uh, these are mostly eBoy files. And we're taking a look here. And this double O system folder, this is a really important folder. This will help us in regards to the one that we're going to keep and kind of the permanent folder that kind of runs the actual um, frame rates and so forth and a couple games. Pretty cool. Or actually one game, the breakout game. Pretty nice. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and go back to the, the uh, removable disk, and I notice here that I'm going to want to save these eBoy files, right? Because look, hey, look, it's a bird. It's a plane. No, it's just a bird. And um, we can see here, this is a bigger image. This is probably like 32 by 32 um, pixel, uh, but you can't see the grid. Um, so I'm just going to hit the X on there, and this configuration is basically letting us know that, hey, we set the frame rate at a certain number. Now, there's usually a default frame rate that I like to keep, I don't really like messing with the configuration, but you could probably try to, if you're good at that stuff, uh, figure some configure on your own. All right, see what I did there. These two files are not important to me, okay, in regards to making some art and helping out with students. These files are super important because, hey, they let me know that, hey, we designed some cool stuff. The eBoys, these are the eBoys examples. These are technically 16 uh, bitmap images. Uh, that big picture that shows you what it is is a GIF file. But these are bitmaps. That's what the uh, game frame uses. Um, these are more like pixels, uh, windows uh, types of files. So that's what a bitmap is. Uh, kind of nice. Um, you'll notice there is zero is what they start off with. This is super huge, okay? And that there's it goes all the way to 15. The longer the numbers, or I'm sorry, the increase in numbers, the longer the animation. So that'll let you know that you can increase the time, make it really nice, but quality over quantity, right? You want to do a really, really nice job. All right, so I'm going to click on the first one, and you're like, oh, yeah, it's so small, I can't see it. But if you zoom in, right, and you're like scrolling with your mouse with the zoom in, a little scroll button in between their uh, left and right click. Um, then you hit the next arrow, it gets smaller again, and so you really can't see any sort of animation. So you kind of have to bear with the animation. We're at frame number two, so I'm just going to go back to zero. And you'll notice that you have to kind of look at it on a small scale, kind of get closer to your screen. Uh, hopefully you have good eyes if you want to see their animation right away. And I'm just going to hit the arrow, and you can see the animation playing, okay? So kind of nice. We're at 10 frames. It's 15, so you can play it all the way to 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then you can notice you'll have to kind of go back. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And you can see the animation. Really kind of nice. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and go back to the zero. Really important that you know that there's a zero that it has to start with. I'm going to hit that X. Now, keeping in mind that we want to keep the art because it's cool, and maybe we need want some cool things to show our buddies. Um, but maybe you do some art, maybe you keep some of them. It's a nice little hodgepodge of uh, coolness. So let's go ahead and make a right click on here, right click on our desktop, go to new, let's go to folder, and I'm just going to call this eBoys, okay, just to kind of give claim to their name of who designed this um, that Jeremy had some extra help with. And you'll notice here the bird, I'm going to keep this 00 system file. So the bird is selected, I'm going to hold the shift key. Hold the shift key and the mayonnaise. Um, go ahead and hold the shift key. We select all these. You can always, if you have them all selected, just hold the control and just click on the double O system so everything else is selected but not the double O system. Really important. Now I'm going to go ahead and right click, cut. You'll notice it kind of changes a little transparency. And then right click, paste. So then it just takes like scissors and just cuts it out of here and puts it here. All right, cut it out, people. Cut it out. All right, so it's going to go ahead and move it to the eBoys folder. You're going to want to save this eBoys folder from your desktop that you just dragged everything or cut it to because you don't want to drag it. Otherwise, it copies it. So we want to cut it and paste it in here. All right, you're, then you're going to save this folder to like an external hard drive, another SD card, not your micro, but another SD card, um, your external hard drive, whatever, but not, you know, maybe you could even save it on your computer. Not a big deal, but just please don't save it on your SD card. Um, you can pick and choose what you want to keep on there. That's kind of nice. Now, um, 10 seconds left. It's uh, moving, moving, moving. Come on, the files are moving. All right, um, so we're just going to kind of then go ahead and be ready, set for our next video. All right, hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, good luck, and uh, bye-bye.